Understanding hair's breadth in English. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, hair's breadth. This expression is quite intriguing and understanding it can add a wonderful touch to your English communication. So, let's dive in. The phrase, hair's breadth, is actually a misinterpretation of the correct term, which is, hair's breadth. This idiom means a very small distance or a very narrow margin. It originates from the idea that a single strand of hair is very thin, representing something that is extremely close or narrowly achieved. To help you understand how to use hair's breadth in everyday conversation, here are a few examples. 1. She missed the target by a hair's breadth, meaning she almost hit the target. 2. He won the race by a hair's breadth, indicating an extremely close victory. 3. The vase fell but missed the ground by a hair's breadth, illustrating that it almost hit the ground but just barely missed. Many people often say, hair's breadth, instead of, hair's breadth. This is a common misunderstanding, likely due to the phonetic similarity between hair, the animal, and hair. Remember, the correct phrase relates to the thinness of a hair, not the animal. I hope this video has clarified the meaning and usage of hair's breadth for you. Remember, it's all about the fine lines and narrow margins. Thank you for watching. And I look forward to sharing more interesting English phrases and idioms in our upcoming videos. Keep practicing, and you'll be a pro in no time.